Kemba, how does your foot feel? Feels good now. Uh, it's uh, just getting used to being back playing and kind of getting used to. Obviously, there's a pin in it now, so it's a little bit different, but I'm getting used to it. It's getting better every day. How does it feel to be back <laughs> on the field? It feels amazing. I mean, this is the first time I've had a, a big injury like this, so it's been definitely tough to be out, but I'm, I'm just happy to be back doing what I love. So. You got the 20 minutes on Saturday. Uh, how do you describe your fitness level right now? you think you're back to full health, or do you need, still need to get the run in a little bit and keep uh, I'm progressing every day. So even today we had a good session. So I'm, I'm, I feel like I'm pushing and I'm getting there every day. That was my first time kind of getting game, game minutes. I felt, I felt good. I felt good on the weekend. So I'm hoping I can just keep progressing like that. And I don't think it'll be too, too long until I'm, I'm fully fit. So I feel good. Yeah, and big road trip coming up for the team, starting with your former team yeah. in, in Tulsa. How much does it mean to you to be able to get your feet back on the field before that trip and now being able to help the team? It definitely, definitely means a lot. I mean, being out was tough, but I just I really wanted to come back and, and help the team the best way I can, kind of bring some energy to that midfield. And obviously, Tulsa was a former team of mine, and I enjoyed being there. So I really wanted to make it back for that trip. So it'll be nice to see everybody, and it'll be nice now that I'm back in the team and, and can help. So hopefully, we can go there and get the result. And how was is, how is training today? How's it been? I know it's been a tough couple of results for you guys, but have you sort of been bouncing back in practice? I feel like the, the, the team has had a good mental mental state. Like, Omid's done a great job uh, pushing everybody. Everyone's kind of responding well. So we just kind of got to stick together, and, and the result the result will come. The result will come. We're, we're on the right track. What do you learn about yourself, and what do you learn about the team when you spend time on the sidelines? Uh, you definitely definitely get to kind of sit back and, and analyze and that's kind of definitely what I what I took this opportunity to do obviously that I was out I, I kind of analyzed myself and, and saw how the team was doing so uh, just been I feel a lot stronger mentally the main thing I'm, I'm definitely a lot stronger mentally and seeing from the outside what I can bring now to the team that I'm back I was able to spend some time and and really see yeah what I can help bring the team and more on the physical side, just talk a little bit about the recovery process. You know, did it go as expected, maybe a little quicker, slower than expected? And how did it feel throughout kind of being sidelined for that long? It, it's a weird one because I actually I feel like I was probably on schedule for, for my recovery. Sometimes it felt like sometimes I was progressing pretty quick and then I would get on the field and obviously there was still that little after I was getting out of the boot and then or getting off crutches, getting into the boot, getting now on the, to the field, starting to run. So. I ended up pretty much making the three months was, was, was my set time when I first uh, got the surgery. So uh, I, I progressed well. I, I, uh, Mike, the trainers, did a, did a great job with me. So I was, I was on schedule and I, I feel good. So I'm just I'm happy to be back.